Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. In the last episode, we we're on a day th we got on to day three of the trial, and uh, Penny is about to tell us what happened five years ago. Okay. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay. Could you tell us a tell us what happened five years ago? Well, I can tell you what I've heard. Apparently, five years ago, someone died, and it was oh, it was Hammer's fault. Is that why he's not a star anymore? So someone died? It was an accident, of course. Anyway, the producer, Ms. Vasquez, managed to hush it up. And that's the dirt she had on Mr. Hammer. And that's why Mr. Hammer would do anything Ms. Vasquez asked him to do. But it was an accident, right? Why didn't they just make it public? Well, you know, Mr. Hammer was a big star back then. They were afraid about what would happen to his career if word got out. But his career died anyway. I see. You know who knows more about this? Miss Oldbag. She was here at the studio back then, you know. Thanks. We'll try asking her. If she'll talk. That should, this should go over well. Uh, did I present? Ah, so this photo was Mr. Hammer all along. It seems that way. Why would Mr. Hammer do something like that? All right, it's, it's been a week since the last recording session. I left this at a very bad <laughs> spot. I'm trying to remember where I, where I was at theory-wise. Wow, wow. It must have taken him forever to collect all these. Kids love these steel, love the steel samurai. They do, don't they? Okay, and sleep. What's that? An empty bottle of sleeping pills. With Mr. Hammer's fingerprints on it. Now I'm really confused. I don't... I feel like I have a pretty... Oh, hello. I've already, I've already asked you everything. Back to... Uh, what, you think you're still slinking around? If you like the place so much, why don't you take over for me? The old windbag doesn't look so good. Everybody's doing their darndest to forget Hammer. Who do they think made Global Studios what it is today? Hammer. It's all due to Hammer. She's starting to froth at the mouth, Nick. Maybe we should keep a safe distance. There we go. Um, I wanted to ask you about five years ago. Oh boy. Here we go. This should go. This should go well. Who told? Who did you hear that from? I, uh, huh? Nichols. Nichols? Nichols, Nick. Penny Nichols, the assistant we talked to. Oh, right. Anyway, we heard about the accident. It was during filming with Jack Hammer. He killed a man, didn't he? Wh Whippersnappers. Dredging up dirt on someone's past like that. And the recently departed, no less. I suppose you think this is fun. No, I'm just doing my job to protect Mr. Powers. And you claim that Hammer stole Powers' costume. You expect me to believe that rubbish? Or do you have some kind of proof? Proof that Hammer stole Powers' costume. Hmm, I have proof. Uh, I'm sorry, Miss Oldbag, but I do have proof. I can prove that Mr. Hammer stole Mr. Powers' costume. Sleeping pills? Here's my proof. What? What's a little empty bottle supposed to prove? It's a bottle of sleeping pills with Mr. Hammer's fingerprints on it. Well, what does that prove? I I'm sure old Hammer had some sleepless nights. Where's your proof that he used those pills on powers? Uh, uh oh. Oh, well, it's good to know I can keep guessing. I actually don't know. Mm -hmm. 
Nick, I'm kind of having trouble figuring that one out, too. Hmm, wrong evidence, but I know Old Bag knows something. I have to get her to talk. Am I... Alright, let's go, let's go back through this. Okay, what do we have that would prove... Okay, what do we have that would prove that? Uh, I don't think it's my attorney's badge. don't know all right I'm gonna sorry I'm gonna I'll, I'll we'll talk this out where where am I all right let's maybe go back to the, the exact question you claim that hammer stole powers costume you expect me to believe that rubbish or do you have some kind of proof Sorry, but I do have proof. I can prove that Mr. Powers, that Mr. Hammer stole Mr. Powers. May, uh, maybe I just go down the line. We already did the sleeping pills. Mr. Powers ate a T-bone steak for lunch, correct? <laughs> well, well, yes, so. This is the plate that he used to eat, that he used to eat that steak. There are traces of sleeping pill. How, did we ever talk about that? Did I, did I just forget? I feel like I would remember that. There are traces of sleeping pill powder on the plate. Hmm. Ha! I, I bet Powers put it in there himself. Even a lightweight like him must have trouble sleeping sometimes. Except I have proof that Mr. Hammer put the pills in. Oh, there we go. Okay. This bottle contains sleeping pills. Mr. Hammer's fingerprints were found on the bottle. There we go. Okay. So I was on the right track. I just... It could just be me being dumb and not remembering that there was, a uh, like, pill residue on it. Does it actually say that in there? Oh, it does. Okay. That's, oh, that's on me. Apologies. <laughs> I see. Poor, poor Hammer. You did wrong, Hammer. Rest your soul. Miss Old Bag. Okay, you win. I'll talk. I'm tired, see? Tired of holding it all in. Miss Oldbag? You're right. Five years ago, there was an accident. A fatal accident. What's worse, a paparazzi took a photo of it. That photo, well, it caused quite a stir. And guess who made it all better? Vasquez. She has ties to the mafia. She has ties to the mafia. <laughs> she silenced that paparazzi. I don't know who to root for in that. That was the beginning. After that, she became a force to be reckoned with here at the studio. I see. But you have to understand, poor old Hammer never meant any harm to anyone. Miss Oldbag. Hold on a minute. Poor Miss Oldbag. Here, take this. A photograph. Well, wait a second. This is the picture. Oh, this is the picture. Is this the trailer in Studio 2? Hammer was supposed to fight with the bad guy on top of those stairs there. He pushed the other actor and the man fell into the flower box. Ah, ha, 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 ha. <sighs> but, but how did you, how did you get this? It w was a long time ago. I don't feel much like talking about it. I understand. Okay. Well, we have our motive. All right. Yeah, I don't. Re I don't remember the sl talking about the sleeping pill powder on the plate. That was probably that was probably the last episode uh, when we were talking to Gumshoe. If I'm trying to remember anything here. Think back, Nick, to the day of the murder. Mr. Hammer put on the Steel Samurai costume. Then he left from here to go to Studio 2? Right. 
But why? I wonder if someone called him, like the director or the producer. See anything we can examine? I'm bushed. Maybe I'll sit down here for a bit. This is exactly why I don't want to get old ever. Hey, I'm still young. I'm just tired. Nick, when you start having to say I'm still young, you know it's all over. But but I am still young. All right, I remember that one. Let's see if any of these are. Nope. Eh. There we go. Studio 2 is down that way. Studio 2, the real scene of the crime. Say, Nick, how did you figure that out again? Well, actually, it's a long story. I'll tell you another time. Ah, That's too bad. I definitely could have used a, a refresher. Mr. Monkey. Studio 1 that I don't think we can get to anymore. I don't have the key card. Yeah, okay. Anything else? Camera. Doesn't seem to be switched on today, which was the case before. Not people in here when they're not filming, right? Nick, let's come here and... Yeah. I'm sure she would just love to let us in. Okay. Hey, Nick. It's Ms. Vasquez. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Maya, you should at least try to be polite. I'm watching the clouds. That's all she had to say? That's all she had to say, apparently. Alright, tell me about Mr. Hammer. Um, excuse me, Mr. Hammer came here on the day of the murder and... Perhaps you didn't hear me. I'm watching the clouds. I'm not interested in talking to you. Do something, Nick. She's really ticking me off. Oh, dear. Um, Mr. Powers wasn't the killer. You don't have to cancel the Steel Samurai. I think I'm tired of the Steel Samurai. You, you did it. Nick, she did it. She's the killer. My fey blood speaks to me. I know it. I know it. Oh, dear. Um, I was wondering if you could tell me about Mr. Manella. You must talk about that man. Perhaps you could talk about it in the trailer. By yourselves. Oh. Oh, dear. Uh. I guess, I mean, the new thing we have is the photograph. So let's start there. She's not even looking. Where? What? Where did you get that? I, well... Old bag. Uh, old? She means a security lady, Miss Old Bag, Nick. Right, anyway. Miss Vasquez, you hid this incident from the press, didn't you? And you used it con to control Mr. Hammer. The wind. The, huh? It's gotten stronger, don't you think? The wind. Your conversation interests me. Let's talk about it more inside the trailer. Nick, she went inside the trailer. <gasps> oh, that's why that one's bent. Wow, so pretty. They're taking good care of these. Don't get too close. That fence looks dangerous. Oh, I thought they would have something to say about that. All right. All right, I forget. You don't, you, you move. You don't click on doors. Trailer. Hmm, you came. Well then, what was that you were talking about? Why is she so eager to talk all of a sudden? Miss Vasquez, you were using that accident. You were blackmailing Mr. Hammer so you could control him, weren't you? That's why he was doing kids shows for petty change. Hmm. So I'm a blackmailer now. Well, that's what it was, wasn't it? I mean, sure, it was an accident. But you used it to drag Hammer down from his rightful place as a star. Oh? I haven't pulled anyone down from anywhere. Mr. Hammer's career went sour of its own accord. But, but... You were the cause. You pressured him. And I think it was just an accident. Excuse me. What is this all about? You keep saying accident, accident. How are you so sure? 
What do you mean? Must I spell everything out for you? Think, what would it be if it wasn't an accident? No. No way. You mean Mr. Hammer did it on purpose? That's what I mean. Where's your proof? Can you prove it? Hmm. <laughs> Just think. Would he have let me run his life for five years over a mere accident? And I ran him hard, believe you me. But, but the security lady said it was an accident. Oh, well, she's a big fan of hammers, you see. She jumped on the reporter who brought that photo into the studio. She wrenched it out of his hands, she did. Gave him a few bruises, too. So that's why she had the photo. She's an old fool. Of course, all the reporter would need is the negatives. He could have made a copy, but he didn't. The only copy of that photo is the one you hold. Give it to me. Now. Well, what? This is valuable evidence. Boys. Oh. Uh-oh. I don't like where this is going. Is this the part where we get disappeared? Um, who are they? Professionals. They're good at erasing various things. What do you think? Would you like to be erased? Well, what? The trial ends tomorrow. How unfortunate. It's a shame you'll have to miss it. Tell me why. Why do you want this photograph so badly? This is Mr. Hammer's dirt, no? Why should D. Vasquez care about it at all? I'm sure you'll have plenty of time to think about that where you're going. So long, friends. Boys, erase away. No! Uh-oh. Hold it right there. I heard everything, pal. D. Vasquez, you're coming down to the precinct with me now. Hmm. Not bad. Very well. It appears this contest will be decided tomorrow, then, in courts. I'll be looking forward to it. Uh, hey, you okay, pal? Sorry I was a little late with my entrance. I don't get many chances to practice that sort of thing. Detective Gumshoe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I was really scared. Huh? Don't mention it, pal. Just doing my job. Detective Gumshoe? Sorry, it's just I've been wanting to say that line ever since I became a detective. Okay, I got one more job to do today. I'm sure we'll run into each other again soon. Well, Nick, it looks like we're getting close to the bottom of this. Who's at the bottom? D. Vasquez. To be continued. At the trial. Okay. Um, I know this is kind of a short episode. But I think I would like to... We'll pause it here. That way we can... Kind of focus on, on the whole trial and not have to stop midway midway through. So I think that's what I'm going to do. So we'll we'll get through a good chunk of the trial in the, uh, in the next episode. Uh, I'm... Very curious to see how this is going to turn out. I feel like there's still more at play. I, I I honestly did not see Hammer being... Like, killing the guy on purpose. I'm, I'm kind of curious to see if that's true. I don't know why Vasquez would lie about that. There doesn't seem to be any reason to. But we'll have to find out in the next episode. I uh, hope you guys are still enjoying this. Let me know what you guys are thinking in the comments. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.